happy Valentine's Day. Today I'm going to show you how to make your own Valentine's God card for your little sweetheart. First you want to open up Adobe Photoshop Elements and make a new blank file. And you can make it whatever size you want. You want it to be bigger than you normally would want it. Uh, so, because of what we're going to do next. And click OK. And you want it to be transparent. And then you want to pick two colors. They're like Valentine's colors. And the, I'm just going to choose nice pink colors. And first, you want to take your darker color and fill it. Then you want to take your custom shape tool and find, go to all element shapes and go down to the very bottom and there should be this registration target to choose that one and you might want to zoom out a little bit and you can just do this. So you want to make sure you have your lighter color on and just go like this. It might take a couple tries to get it perfectly the way you want it. After you have that, you can just merge that down and you can zoom back in. And this is what you have for right now. Then you can go to filter, then go to distort, and to twirl. And you want to twirl it, so go like this. Just twirl it as much as you want it. It's okay. We'll have this right here, and that's okay because you just you can just uh, crop it out. So now we, we want to zoom in 200% because that's how it will look. And you can make everything smaller. So you have to zoom back out. Not in, but out. Select everything. Make it a little smaller. And that looks good. And I can zoom back into 100%. And you can just crop it to the way you want it. To the shape you want it. And I just want it like this. Then what you want to do is take your custom shape tool and get a, a nice dark red for hearts. Then go to shapes and find your heart, which is right here. Then you want to make a heart in the center of this little solid color. So it's like this. Then you want to right click on unshape one and simplify the layer. Then click on layer and go to layer style and then style, style settings. You want to add a, a bevel which makes it 3D-ish looking and just add whatever kind of bevel you want. And then you can add a glow. I'm just going to add a nice outer glow like this. And press OK. And then you want to right click on that again and supply it again. And right click on it again and duplicate it once. And then you can move it over here and you can make it about half the size. Put it wherever you want. I'm just going to put it right here. And then you can take the original shape and duplicate it again and make it even smaller like that and then you can just merge visible which merges them all together then you want to right click right here and go to your line tool and click and make have a white color then you want to drag from the center of the heart right the tip right here and just drag up
And then you can just merge visible. And so you have this. Then if you want to add Valentine's like text to it, you can click your text tool. And I've downloaded this Valentine font. Uh, there's a link in the description about how to get font downloaded fonts onto your Photoshop. And you can just click anywhere you want your text and I'm just gonna put Happy Valentine's day and I'm just going to click right here and then I'm just gonna warp the text which is right here and I'm just gonna make it rise and just make some look cool then after you have this you can just right click on text over here and click simplify layer and then go up to layer layer style style settings and add a bevel if you like and you can add a glow I'm just gonna make mine a nice shade of pink kind of see it and you can make a little drop shadow stroke. I don't really like the stroke for this, but and then I click OK. And then you can just simplify that again and merge visible. And so you have this. And if you want, you can just take a nice black color and take your, your rectangle select and select like one pixel around the edge. And then select inverse and just take your brush tool and just brush around the edges like so and so when you click off it it's nice like that and that's how you make a happy valentine's day card so, happy Valentine's Day, and I hope you have a great day with your sweetheart. Thanks. Subscribe, comment, thumbs up. Bye.